Welcome everyone to the Israeli debut of Project Debater. Uh, we have an exciting debate topic today, which is we should end the use of mass surveillance. In the discussion today, I support the people's right to privacy. No matter who they are, people should be protected. Mass surveillance is significantly damaging free expression and the free flow of information around the world. It erodes intellectual freedom and damages the social fabric of affected societies. It is unjustified, unnecessary, and has no place in a free society. It threatens to halt the historic expansion of civil liberties and personal freedom. It's worth noting that we already live in a status quo in which there is mass surveillance in a lot of places. There are security video cameras in a lot of big cities. Hell, we even implemented it in the World Cup with a VAR system. This is mass surveillance for football. Do we really feel in an in a Orwellian dystopia? Sci-fi world? Yes, definitely. But Orwell? No, I don't think so. Video surveillance is being used to actually help catch criminals after the fact. Now, will it entirely stop crime? No, some, cri some criminals are sophisticated, but most crimes aren't being done by criminal masterminds. Most of them are, are um, very passionate crimes or, or, or inexperienced criminals, and we can definitely catch them later on if we put mass surveillance on. But moreover, it deters future criminals and future crimes from taking place. One of the main clash points in today's debate was over constitutionality. To recap, Yad Arbach believes that mass surveillance can help prevent crime, while I think otherwise. One of my answers was that mass surveillance is unconstitutional. This is an important clash because it discusses the boundaries of law and where we want to place them. I believe the data I presented made my arguments more convincing.